Hey, it's Acoustic Paint, I'm Elizabeth, and today I'm going to be comparing these three erasers. In this corner, we have the Prismacolor Premier Magic Rub Erasers. In this corner, we have the Moo Professional Grade Eraser. And in this corner, we have the Faber-Castell Kneaded Eraser. Okay, so these are all pretty inexpensive er erasers. So the first eraser we're going to be testing and looking at is the Moo Professional Grade Eraser. So I opened this eraser about a week ago and I haven't used it a single time. I picked these up almost a month ago at Hobby Lobby and they've just been sitting in my shelf. So the first thing I noticed about it was the smell. These things absolutely stink. I don't know if it's just my erasers that I got or just all Moo erasers, but they just smell like old tires. Like I haven't, like the smell hasn't dissipated at all. But Maybe that won't matter. On the package, it said that it doesn't make all those little eraser crumbs. It like rolls into a nice long eraser crumb, singular. So we're gonna put that to the test with pen, uh, colored pencil, um, graphite pencil. This is HB, so normal graphite pencil. Huh, okay, so I just erased the uh, graphite pencil and it did a pretty good job. It did smear a little bit. Let me see if that'll clean it up. And this cleans it up really nicely. And here's what I was saying. It doesn't leave a single, like one crumb, it leaves a long crumb strand. I don't know, okay. Now let's move on to the colored pencil. It didn't erase the colored pencil Hardly at all. I mean, it kind of lightened the pigment, but other than that, it didn't erase at all. Finally, the pen. And I don't have high hopes for any of the erasers to erase the pen. Yeah, These, this just doesn't erase the pen or the color pencil very well. So overall, um, I wasn't really sure what to expect with this eraser. I mean, it's cut kind of unevenly, and again, it stinks. But I, I think if I were, like if I were in a pinch and I needed an eraser, this is one I would use. This next eraser is the Prismacolor Magic Rub. Now, I got these as a 12 pack. It's really good for erasing large sections of a drawing because you can really scrub at it. Wow, I'm actually kind of shocked. The Moo eraser worked better than the Prismacolor eraser on graphite pencil. I Wow, okay. I use this so often in my normal drawings that I'm just so used to it leaving like a light amount of streaking and things. There's a lot more graphite left on the page here than there is by the Moo eraser, and as you can see, a bunch of streaking. So, I know, I might have to swap out my favorite eraser. Oh well, it sounds pretty good, but we're not done yet. Okay, so where the Moo Eraser picked up a better graphite, this picked up a better um, colored pencil, I assume because this is the Prismacolor colored pencil eraser, so I guess it's meant to erase colored pencil, but still, this there's obviously some pigment there, and I have used this before to erase colored pencil, you can see the brown, um, and it just, like it does here, lightens the pigment. And with the pen, absolutely nothing. Maybe I should have chosen a better pen, like an actual erasable pen, but... Okay, this last eraser is the Faber-Castell Kneaded Eraser, and I picked this up about two weeks ago, and I have been using it almost every single day since then. I just really, really like this thing. So, um, like the Prismacolor eraser, it can erase large sections of a drawing, but I also like to use it when I just need to pick up like a light amount of pigment. Like, for example, if I were uh, sketching a drawing out with graphite pencil and then I wanted to erase the outline lightly so I could color it with colored pencil so the colored pencil wouldn't mix with the graphite. That's what I would use this for. Also, you know, it's a kneaded eraser, so it's super squishy and fun to play with if you're 
kind of into that stuff. Okay, let's test this out. Wow, so out of all of the erasers, the Faber-Castell kneaded eraser is the best. It left the least amount of graphite on the page without smearing, so very impressed. This came in a two-pack, and because, unlike other erasers, it doesn't leave crumbs, or in the Moo eraser's case, little strands, it doesn't lose a piece of itself every time, so it essentially is a forever eraser. Okay, so with the Prismacolor colored pencil, it didn't erase at all, if... and as expected, did absolutely nothing for the pen. That's all for me. Um, I honestly think out of all these erasers, the Faber-Castell kneaded eraser has been my favorite. Um, the Moo eraser actually surprised me so much because I expected it to be pretty bad considering the smell was just awful. You know, I'm just, I think I'm, I'm going to keep all three with me when I go, when I draw, but this is the one I use the most, so, and I honestly think the Moo eraser is better than the Prismacolor eraser when it comes to erasing graphite. The Prismacolor eraser is better than either of these at erasing colored pencil, and all three just are terrible at erasing pen, or I have the wrong pen. Thanks so much for watching, and have a fabulous day. Bye!